student of 8th standard of Montessori English Medium High School, Hyderabad. I am here to explain to you about the concept of social studies that is lines on the globe. I hope you have noticed many lines across the globe, right? Some lines run from the North Pole to the South Pole, while others run from the East to the West. These are the imaginary lines drawn by the map makers. Well, do you know why these lines are drawn on the globe? It is to locate places on the globe. Now, let us have a look to the most important lines. The concept of the lines on the globe is known as the latitudes and the longitudes. Now, let me demonstrate what latitudes are. Latitudes are the imaginary lines that runs from the west to the east. These are also known as the parallels. Can you spot these lines? The longest of these lines is known as the equator. It divides a globe into two equal halves called hemispheres. One is the northern hemisphere and the other is the southern hemisphere. Now let me demonstrate what longitudes are. Longitudes are the imaginary lines that runs from the north pole to the south pole. These are also known as the meridians. There are two main longitudes. One is the Greenwich or Prime Meridian and the other is the International Date Line which is also known as the 180 degrees east or west longitude. Hence, the globe has a network of these latitudes and longitudes of a grid-like structure and help us to locate the place. By the way, do you know what is the use of these latitudes and longitudes? Let me explain. If you know the latitudes and the longitudes of a place, you can easily locate it on the globe or a map. This is all about lines on the globe. Hope you liked the information in this video. If you really liked it, please share it. Thanks for watching. Welcome everybody to respect your kids and your teachers and my dear friends. I am Anishanika. I am Anishanika. I am Anishanika. I am Anishanika. From Montessori English Medium High School. For the standard, today I will be explaining what is it with the help of model. So let's start. Water from the surfaces of various water bodies gets heated by the sun and changes into water vapor. And this rises up in the sky. This process is called evaporation. The water vapor has also up to the sun. Comes in Thank you. Hi everyone. My name is P. Samanvi. I am from class third. I will tell you about homophones. A homophone is a word that sounds the same as another word or words but has a different meaning and spelling. Now, here are some examples. B and B. B E B meaning is to exist. B E E B meaning is a flying insect. Break and break. B R E A K break meaning is to separate something. B R E A K E break meaning is to make a vehicle go slow on stop. Week and week. W E E K week meaning is a period of seven days. W E A K week meaning is not strong. Four and four. F O U R four meaning is a number. F O U R four meaning is because of. By and by. B Y by meaning is beside. B U Y by meaning is purchase. Heal and heal. H E A L heal meaning is to become healthy again. H E E A heal meaning is backpack of food. Deer and deer. D E E R deer meaning is wild animal. D A R R deer meaning is beloved on loud. N O T not and not. K N O T not meaning is to tie. N O T not meaning is use it for showing the opposite. Sum and sum. S O M is sum meaning is unspecified number on a amount. S U M sum meaning is the whole a amount. Aunt and aunt. A N T aunt meaning is a very small insect. A U N T aunt meaning is the wife of one's uncle. C and C. S E S C meaning is a large area of salty water. S E E C meaning is to look. 
our and her o u r our meaning is belonging to us h o u r her meaning is a period of 60 minutes thank
water into the stones allowing water to pass through the stones into pebbles next the water passes through the pebbles into sand and then through the sand it goes into cotton finally we obtain purified water
బహు వచ్చనము రెండు లేదా అంతకంటే ఎక్కువ వస్తువుల గురించి కానీ వ్యక్తుల గురించి కానీ తెలుపున్నది బహు వచ్చనము కొన్ని పదములు నిత్య బహువచనములుగా ఉపయోగించబడతాయి ఇవి పాలు కందులు పెసలు మొదలైనవి ఏకవచనము బహువచనము టమాట టమాటాలు ఏనుగు ఏనుగులు చేప చేపలు ఐస్ క్రీమ్ ఐస్ క్రీమ్లు ధన్యవాదములు హలో మై నేమ్ ఇస్ When the moon is between earth and the sun, we cannot see the moon at all. This is called new moon. After two to three days, we can see some part of the moon. This place is called a rabbit reset. And we come to the new moon. We can see half of the moon. This is called first quarter. So what three days after the first quarter, more than half of the moon is visible. This place is called rabbit reset. if so after the new moon we can see full moon this is because full side of the moon facing the earth gets sunlight now the moon begins its return journey from the full moon to new moon the next phase is the waning event as the moon is not as in red the phase the next phase is last quarter followed by the waning crescent when the moon comes back we can see the earth as in red and the new moon faces again Thank you. Hi everyone, my name is Prima Hathi. I am studying in the fifth grade. In previous video, my friends have explained about computer as its part. Today I am going to tell about hardware and software. Hardware, all physical components of a computer that can be touched or seen are called hardware. Hardware includes all inputs, outputs, processing and storage devices hardware examples go hardware examples keyboard mouse mic joystick monitor printer scanner speaker motherboard microprocessor power supply cd rom ram hard disk rom software set of instructions that are given to the computer to perform some specific task is called software or program so software instruct the computer what to do and how to do software examples okay. software examples windows dos ms office c++ gmail google drive zoom google chrome social media software youtube android operating system acrobat reader skype in daily life we use different softwares for different tasks for online classes we use zoom for record keeping we use dbms for typing documents we use ms word for calculations we use ms excel for playing games we use different game software in hospitals banks airlines weather forecasting etc we use different softwares for different purpose thank you everyone my name is kankya i am studying fourth class i will tell about anagram now an anagram is a word made by arranging the letters of another word in a different order c s e a l c cell s c a l d cell fried f r i e d fried fired f i r e d fired good c o u l d good cloud c l o u d cloud heart h e a r t heart yet e a r t h e a r t bones o w n s bones snow s n o w snow star s t a r star rats r a t s rats leaf l e a f leaf flea flea f l e a f flea teach t e a c h teach 
cheat C H E A T cheat sign S I G N sign sing S I N G sing mail M I L E mail line L I M E line thank you my name is Bhivisha I am from class 3 today I will show you how to use this and that this is a tree that is a tree this is a ball that is a ball this is a car that is a car this is a house that is a house thank you Hi everyone, my name is Harika. I am studying in first class. Today I am going to tell about community helpers. Community helpers are the people from our society who <coughs> helps us daily by providing some or other kinds of services. Community helpers are teacher, doctor, policeman, milkman, farmer, baker, cobbler, sweeper. Blood. A cobbler repairs shoes and polishes our shoes. Farmer. Farmer cultivates fruits and vegetables for the people. A baker bakes a delicious cakes of ashes and cookies for us. A milkman delivers a milk. Teacher helps us to learn different things and also teaches us about good manners and discipline. Policeman. A policeman works on the safety of people. He uses gun knives to a doctor, a doctor helps us to when we are sick or hurt today. Prescribe a medicine, doctor reduces the stethoscope. Sweeper, a sweeper sweeps and keeps the street clean.
from golf class. Today we are explaining about Olympic club. Oh, the Olympic symbol consists of this important international event. Olympic Games began in honor of this in this at Olympia. Olympic Days is celebrated every year on 23rd June. These games are held once every four years. The Olympic symbol consists of this interlocking rings. The color of the five rings is blue, black, red, orange, green. These five rings represent the five continents of the world. The five continents are Africa, Europe, Asia, America, Australia. Thank you, everyone. Thank you, everyone. Hi everyone, my name is Sham. I am studying in St. class. Today I am going to tell about our natural bird. Peacock is the natural bird of India. It represents beauty and grace. It is a beautiful bird with a long blue neck and colorful feathers. Thank you. G for giraffe, G I R A F F E, giraffe. 
H for hippo, H I P P O, hippo. I for ibis, I B I S, ibis. K for jackal, J A C K A L, jackal. K for kangaroo, K A N G A R O O, kangaroo. K for kangaroo, K A N G A R O O, kangaroo. L for lion, L I O N, lion. M for monkey, M O N K E Y, monkey. N for nail guy, N I L G A I, nail guy. O for old, O W L old. P for peacock, P E C O C K, peacock. Q for quail, Q U A I L, quail. O for rabbit, O R A B B I D, rabbit. S for snake, S N A K E, snake. T for tiger, T I G E R, tiger. U for unicorn, U N U N I C O R N unicorn. V for vulture, V U L T U R E vulture. W for wolf, W O L F wolf. X for X ray fish, X R A Y F I S H X ray fish. Y for rat, Y A K rat. Z for zebra, Z E B R A zebra. Thank you. Don't depend on others. Don't give up.